So this question looks like it's going to be a translate word problem question. We can see that pretty immediately because it is a word problem, right? It is more than four lines long. So all I want to do is once I start reading, I want to write down any quantitative information and make sure that I'm, you know, trying to make sense of what I read while reading it instead of just trying to rush through and read the whole thing and then risk the danger of having to like, you know, reread it and reread it to try to get the information out. So the question says a forest contains different species of trees. Okay. Let T represent the total number of trees in the forest. All right. So there we go. T equals trees or number of trees. Let H represent the number of hickory trees. Okay. So if T is all trees, so H is hickory trees, All right, Which obviously means H can never be larger than T. And let K represent the number of oak trees. So K equals oak. If a tree is selected at random, right? So we have T trees that we're choosing from. And a, if a tree is selected at random from the forest, which expression represents the probability? Okay, probability. This is a key word. Anytime you see this word probability, I want you to have this thought. It is a fraction. The numerator is what you want, right? So I'll say I want. And the denominator is the total. Sometimes I say it's what I have. I have. Okay? So what I want over what I have. In fact, let's just make it simple. What I want over what I have will always work. All right, so what are we finding the probability of? If a tree is selected at random from the forest, which expression represents the probability of selecting a tree that is neither hickory nor oak? So what do I want? I want a tree that is neither hickory or oak. So all the trees in a forest are T. I need to subtract from that the hickory trees. I need to subtract from that the oak trees. And then I'm choosing out of what I have, which is the entire forest, which is T. Hopefully that makes sense, right? What I want is every tree that's not hickory, so subtract hickory, and not oak, so subtract oak. What do I have? Well, I have the whole forest. How many trees are in the forest? T number of them, right? So here is my probability, and therefore choice B is my answer.